Yeah. <clears throat> my people of Nigeria, my name is Smart Madhu Ajaja. I they live for America, Houston, Texas, for America, and I'm they live. I be nurse, I they write, I be small businessman, and I be activist. Activist not somebody when they fight for the rights of others. Somebody when no go fit closing eyes when things they go bad. So now then take no me or all over the world. And this is some of you on no I never know me before. But I run for Senate. This election went past. That will rule election. When no work for everywhere. Now will rule people will buy votes. The one will not buy vote, then go on thumb print. For inside Bush bring and change the re votes. No na that na so then take push me come out for that or not. But we not go tire. The thing be say and not borrow money. And nobody if he tell me what I go what I what I go do. I get my own mind. In fact, I be the thing when some of party leaders for the party when I first day before, not take like they say yes, now you be the best one. But with the fear, say we're not gonna feel control you. So now they can't use Uruuru do me. So when I see as the thing they waka me can work out before before they do one. So as I walk out now, now their party can collapse for data. So now we can I can't enter AAC. Hey, if you be nurse for now, really, you know, you want uh, the progress of Nigeria, just join AAC. Not mind waiting that say they happen for inside the party. The party is a party of good people when we want the good of Nigeria. They are younger people. People, some of them don't travel. They don't see better life. They don't see better country. So nine they won't come bring on Nigeria. Join the people one day in Nigeria. So me and a nurse, and they tell all Nigerian nurses when we want the good of Nigeria. Men and join AAC. That's part of it. The next thing, when they bother me so much now about this quack nursing. Quack nurses. Quack. Quack nurse now, wuru wuru nurse, fake nurse. You not go to school of nursing. You not get, you not get license to be a nurse. The people when they train them now, doctors won't get private clinics one day in Nigeria. Their organization, the, the one when they're supposed to look after them, when they call the Nigerian Medical and Dental Council, they know they do their work. Instead, then they play politics with other professionals one day for the health industry for Nigeria because they won't control everything. Now then go be minister, they go, then go be secretary, they go, then go be commissioner of health for everywhere. For 60 years, they run our country's healthcare system into the ground. Tell me why within any person, me, when they here, unless say, I don't know where I did again, now I'm going to allow make can enter any hospital for Nigeria because Nigeria not get a hospital. Don't worry about some big hospital when we don't have building them get inside, nothing they inside. Or when they will go carry those big equipment come from America, they're not going to uh, uh, use them. Or some of the equipment itself, not dead equipment. The thing we say then they use and they bring a patient come. Make them come and say, oh, these people get the equipment. Now lie. We shall be waiting to happen. Now inside head, <coughs> head care, now my day. Since 1987, I'm a graduate as a nurse. I don't work for Nigeria. I work for South Africa. I work for, for I work for United States. You know, five specialty areas. The area one I know, I get medical and surgical nursing license. I get um, I get experience for industrial. I get uh, experience for orthopedic. I get experience for correctional. Like people want to work around criminals. People when they put for inside prison, correctional nursing. I did that one. Then I can't get oncology certificate, oncology nursing experience. Journal. Five areas. So that is not a joke. So you know, person won't go tell me how hospital supposed to look. The hospitals when we get for Nigeria now. Now hospital when the colonial master bring come for us since nineteen whatever. Nigeria not they change. We not they improve anything. Instead, the whole country, the worker go back. How long we will do this? Nine, I count the verse. Some nurses, when they train, go to school where well, well. Young people, this younger generation of nurses, very smart kids. 
that will finish. You know how many Nigeria they graduate every year? About 300,000 of them every year. They will graduate them, no job for them. Government not hire them. Private hospitals not fit hire them. I cry when someone knows them saying that 13,000 naira naimi they end for a month. A who knows when when go school. School of nursing not be the one when not be joking. I'm I'm tell you the truth. The curriculum is so strong, so 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 broad. But Nigeria not get respect for nurses. Why? Because some doctors they train nurse Eliza according to Ndigbo and acquire nurse Eliza. The person when they go from they'll tell us they bring your plate basin when you carry for head come learn how to be a nurse now they think one some doctors for nigeria and then they cause this problem and now how is it affecting us now our people they suffer because the nurse will not go to school you don't know anything about nursing you don't know anything about anatomy you don't know anything about physiology you don't know anything about disease you can't put your life in his or her hand now death you they ask why many people they die for Nigeria these days? People go just go hospital. Iwaka go heady. At least make it go check itself. The next thing now, uh, no bitch will come to here. Our people are they draw on our ear now. Private hospitals are not the best places to go anymore. I beg. Most of them they use quack nurses. Quack nurse now nah, fake. Fake nurse. Ururu nurse. You don't know anything. So, make I ask you a question. You get some people get diabetes. Diabetes get too extremes. He says, sometimes your sugar turn too high. You get what we call diabetic hyperglycemia. Sometimes it did too low. You will go get hypoglycemia. These two extremes, they are very dangerous. That can cause you death. So, when you read that, the doctor not day, you get this kind of high blood sugar. When come be saying that one small thing they go do, the person go come back. Or you, your blood sugar come day so low. One small cube of sugar you go put for mouth, you go come back normal. When it happen, this quack nurse no know. Because he no go to school. He no sabi anything. Now so he go tell you, he say, oh, <laughs> make I call doctor. Doctor go soon come. Now so your brother or your sister or your mother, your pekin. Go die for your eyes like that for small thing that can be prevented. So the Nigerians, this fight against quack nurses, me, I have taken it personal. And I'm calling all or they call our members of public, ordinary people, because now we they suffer. You not get money to go oversee treatment when anything happened to you. So the best thing that to find a way, put our lives in the hands of those once I be the work. Please. This quack nurse business, it don't take when it start. All of us now, we know them. Speaking when you don't grow now, all of a sudden you come begin to say, nah, nursing be. You not go in the school of nursing. You not go fear. I beg. Especially this thing that happen for private clinics. Around the whole of our country. And they tell her now, make her stand with us. You see, to be a nurse is much more than just giving injection. Or serving medication. Nurses are very academic. The nurse, when when you meet, not the nurse I be, I can address the whole world as I just talk to you. I can sit down in front of uh, Donald Trump and I will tell him what I what I want to tell him. I will sit down for where Buhari day and I will tell him what I, whatever I want to tell him. Nurse Eliza no go feed one. We are very intelligent. Nurses are some of the smartest people on earth. Our educational curriculum is very different from the ones who go direct straight into the university. It's a different ball game because our study now study of human being. We study human being. We they study disease and how disease affect human being. It's not a joke. It not be like somebody want go study political science or go study history. We are dealing with human being. So that is why we are very careful. That is why we are very... They say, some of us, they, some of my friends, they say, why are you so difficult with details? Yes, a nurse is supposed to be very aware of everything around him or her so that mistake that can cause somebody's life not will happen. Now we, that's why we are like this. We are very diligent, 
better. But doctors, majority of Nigerian doctors don't like those who will challenge what they do. If you come and prescribe a drug when I know say go kill somebody, I know go give that drug. And I will not allow you to administer it. If you administer it and anything happens to that patient, I will make sure that you are held accountable. So our people want be doctors, they don't like those who know to challenge them. So that is why they are easy to look for those they can shut down and they say yes sir, yes sir. There are some useless nurses too. When not they read. Just like you have some stupid doctors too. I see a lot of, I saw a lot of them in the course of my practice. Doctors when you go even begin ask which school this one go. Now so it be for nursing. Some some are dumb. But majority of, of the nurses are very smart people that I know. Like my own class in 19, between 1984 and 1987, all of us went to Bender State School of Nursing then. All of us, when we graduate, we not touch ground. Bender State government broke the arrangement agreement we signed with them. They put us on bond. In those days, when you finish school, they will say, make you serve uh, for two years. Because... We not pay school fees. Now government pay us school fees. They give us free food. I was a football player.